Hi, and welcome to day one of adding and subtracting integers. Today we're just going to break into the idea of how you would add and subtract positive and negative numbers. So first let's talk about what is an integer. Does anyone know what an integer is out there? Anybody? Anybody? An integer is another term for a whole number. It can be positive or negative. So some examples of integers are 5, 8, negative 2, negative 4. Those are some integers. And then when we add them, they have some rules to help us to remember what to do. We add and subtract them. So this is what we're going to use as a way to remember what to do. Same signs add different signs subtract. You might want to write that down somewhere. And then keep sign of the bigger digit. So I'm going to give you a second or maybe you can pause and write that down. We're just going to be working with this one today, I think. Yeah. But um, we'll keep referring back to this. Okay. So let's do some examples so that you can do your work. Okay. So we said different signs subtract and keep the sign of the bigger digit. So if we have one like negative 3 plus 5. So they have different signs. This is a negative, this is a positive, and we said subtract. So we subtract the digits, the difference between them is two, and we're gonna keep the sign of the larger digit. Five is a larger digit than three, so we're gonna keep the sign of the five, and the five is positive, so we're gonna keep it at a positive two. Okay, let's look at another example. The positive number could be first, and it could be seven plus negative 10. So these have different signs, so we're going to subtract. So 10 and seven, when we subtract, we would get three. That's the difference between them. And then keep the sign of the larger digit. 10 is larger than seven, so we'll keep the sign of the 10, which is negative. And so when this is simplified, this is negative three. So it's as simple as that. Um, if you have, if you can't remember, always come back to the video to see these examples. And hopefully that will help you to um, get through the work that you have to do today.